Hi guys and welcome back to our third session or lesson three of our at home ACP activities. So what we're going to do today is we're going to recap some of our running skills and we're also going to have a little look at changing direction. We call that agility and it's being able to change direction at speed. And we're going to see how well me and George can change direction when we're playing our little activities. What we're going to do to start with though is we're going to recap the game from last week where we had a little race and we had to do our tag. So we're going to recap that now and then I'll show you the next activity. So George, let's get ready. So remember, we always take in turns to start the race. So I'm going to start the race to begin with and the race is really simple. It's a race up and back and as well as that, I'm trying to tag George and George might try and tag me. Okay, one, two, three, go. And I'm going to try and win the race. Do you know what? I'm going to win the race. I'm not going to get tagged. Oh, look at that. 1 0 to Mr. Patrick. Because I won the race, and nobody did a tag. Now remember, we tag, we get a point for the tag. George might be really quick and he might be able to tag me this time. It's your turn to say go, George. Ready, steady, go. Ah, George got me with a tag. George won the race. Does anyone know what the score was? George got a tag and won the race. I think it's two to George and zero to me. Last race before I show you our next activity then. Here we go. My turn to say go, George. Yeah. yeah. Ready, steady, go. Oh, I got the tag and I won the race. So that time it was two to me, and zero to George. Okay, we're gonna play our next activity. This is one of my favorite activities. George has never played this one before, but it's so easy to play. I'm gonna see if you and George can work it out. You ready, George? Yeah. Okay, so we just did rock, paper, scissors, shoot. George won because I had scissors and he had rock. George? With two feet, do the biggest jump you can do and land and stand still. Whoa, good jump, George. Here we go again. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. I won that one because I had rock and he had scissors. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. George won that one. What are you going to do, George? Well done. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. George won again. Off you go, George. Big jump. Oh, look, we're side by side now. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, Mr. Patrick won. Big jump for me. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. George won. He's going to get over the finish line. He's got one more jump to do and he's going to win. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Mr. Patrick won. I've still got a good chance of winning. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. And Mr. Patrick got the next one. It's very close. I'm going to pick up my microphone. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Mr. Patchett won the game. So there you go. What a simple game that is. You just play rock, paper, scissors. Whoever wins gets to jump. Can you have a little think about another way you could play that game? Is there anything you could do rather than jumping with two legs? I'm going to show you. So here we go. So George is going to go back to his spot. And I'm back at mine. So I'm quite good at jumping. And George, he doesn't like jumping quite so much. So do you know what we're going to do this time? I'm going to jump with one foot. But George, you can either jump with two feet or one feet. So here we go. And there's another rule. When you land now, you have to be still. You're not allowed to move. You're not allowed to fall over. When you land, you need to be completely still or balanced. Okay. You ready, George? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. 
Mr. Patchy at one legged job, then I've got to balance as well. Oh, tricky for me. Rock, paper, scissors, sheep. George won that one. Off you go, George. Great job, George. Rock, paper, scissors, sheep. 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 Oh my goodness, we have both got the same lines. Rock, paper, scissors, sheep. George won that one. Off you go, George. So I won that one. Apologies, George, go back. My fault. My fault. Okay. And so on and so on, guys. So that's how we play our second activity. Just another variation on that. If you don't want to jump forwards, you can even play the game and jump sideways. Do you know what? If you find that really easy, you can even jump sideways with one foot or jump sideways with the other foot. Completely up to you. So that game is rock, paper, scissors, and you have to get to your partner's end line. And whoever wins has done very, very well with their jumping. So well done, guys. That's great. Okay, guys. So I said at the start of this session that we were going to work on a special skill. Can you remember what that was? It was agility. And I said agility is changing direction at speed. So when you're running around and you're constantly changing direction. So we're going to do a little game now that's going to work on our agility. And again, you need a partner for this, so whoever's at home can have a little go with you. So I've got three cones. I've got a cone there, a cone there, and a cone there. And you might be thinking, well, at home, I haven't got any cones. That's fine. You could put a sock there, a spoon there, and your favourite toy there. It doesn't matter, as long as you've got three things down. So what we're going to do now, really simple game. I'm allowed to travel wherever I want. I can go through the middle, I can go through the side, I can go back through the middle, I can go anywhere I want in my triangle shape. George, he's got a tough job, he's got to catch me. But George is not allowed to go through the middle, he's only allowed around the outsides. And then we're going to have a little swap and a change. Are you ready to play, George? Yeah. Are you going to be super quick and speedy? I'll try my best. He's going to try his best, that's all we can ask for. Okay, are you ready, George? Yeah. In three, two, one, go. So George is only allowed around the outside, he's going to try and catch me. Oh no, George caught me. Well done, George. So we're going to see if George can catch me one more time before we swap. Okay, here we go. So I'm moving forwards, I'm moving sideways, I'm moving backwards. Oh look, I'm getting to grips with this game now. Oh no, George caught me again. Well done, George. So now we're going to swap over. George has caught me twice, and now it's my turn to catch George. So. Whenever you're ready, George. Three, two, one, go. George hasn't left the triangle yet, though. Hopefully, oh, I just about managed to catch George. So did you notice then, George stayed in the triangle. So George, I'm gonna set you a challenge. Now, when you play this game, I want you to see if you can move around and go around the outside of the cones as well. Yeah. Okay, three, two, one, go. I think I know where he's going. Oh. Well done, George. Great running. Oh. And I just got him. So, I bet if you're like me, you want to play this game for points. So here we go. Both can have one go each. Every time, you move around the outside of the cone, you get one point. Okay. Oh, it's very tiring. Are you ready, George? Yeah. Three, two, one, go. What trick, George? That's two points for me. Put my cone back quickly, sorry. Two points for me. Three points for me. Oh, George managed to catch me. So I got three points. Let's see if George can beat my score. Three, two, one, off we go. Oh, he's tricked me. Oh, well done, George. George is on three now. He's going to get his fourth one. 
Oh! And me and George got a draw then. Because we got three points each. Is there any ways that you think we could settle a draw? I'm just having a think. I've got an idea. So here we go, George. I got three points and you got three. So we're going to play rock, paper, scissors. Best of one. Yeah. And that decides who the winner was. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. And there you go. George won. So that's the end of session three. Remember, key skill, we looked at agility, changing direction quickly, at speed. Give it a go. Good luck, guys. See you later.